What's up everyone? This is Atleti. It's our save. Now I wasn't going to do it on YouTube, but there's been so much going on with wide centre-backs, with the tactics, with the insane, insane squad that Atletico Madrid have got. I've got to bang it on the tube. <laughs> How's it going everyone? Welcome back again. My name is Neil, the channel is Stinger. Glad to have you here. So this is Atleti. This is our beta save, if you like. What is a beta save? It's different to a main save because we use it to learn the game, have a little look around, get to grips with the match engine. And we did that today on stream. We'll more of that later. But this is my team. This is Atletico Madrid. You see by the league table there, we've started pretty decent, but I'm about to rip it up and change it completely. There's the results. Now you can see there that it's proper Atletico Madrid style, isn't it? 3-0, 1-0, 0-0. We haven't conceded a goal. Super, super solid. But for me, something's just not clicking. If I just take a random game like this game against Elk at home, we should be dominating that game, right? So here it is. Play this here live on stream on Twitch. You can join me over there. And you can see 18 shots, 7 on target. But to be honest, the game, it kind of flattered us a bit. You can see the system that I went with. And I'll tell you, I'll be honest with you, I only went with that system because I really wanted to have a look at how the wide centre-backs are flowing. Like we all do. But it's not working. So that is a system that we started off with. We built it live on stream. It took us about, probably about 40 minutes, you know, to get it all locked and loaded. With this tactic, it looked pretty. There was some nice movement, especially from the front three. You can always see Felix and Suarez have got that link up already. But... This squad, which we're going to get to now, is so top-heavy, it's scary. If you come across an Atletico Madrid, run, run and hide, because their front six, ridiculous. So I'm lying to myself playing this free at the back system. So right now, right now, we're changing our tactic. First up, I'm bringing my midfielder forward into that role there. I'm going to have three, three in behind one striker. We'll move Lorente next to Koke. Already they have a nice relationship. I'm going to drop Lodi back, Trippier back to a more flat, if you like, flat back four. But the two fullbacks are still going to be bombing on. I'm looking at this at the minute. I'm looking at this 4 2 3 1 variation. Not the dreaded 4 2 3 1 wide. We're going to go narrow as hell and allow movement from these lot. 1 2 3 4 interchanging. Yeah, I like this. I'm also toying with dropping Koke and Hermoso back into that role as well against the likes of Juve but we'll see we'll see how it goes we want to give this one a trial first so let's see crew we're going to go attacking because Sochi that have started the season poorly as you can see there two losses and the draw but they do have Isaac up front and David Silver in midfield there's my crew in this adventurous formation let's see how it goes eh right about 20 minutes gone pretty tight pretty dire game so far to be honest I'll probably take a draw away to Sochi Dad, but it's not quite it's not quite working yet I mean, holy hell, I couldn't bring you any highlights because it was that, that bland. Stats in the corner there. Sochi had the best of it. We've had two shots, both off target. So this is my average possession with the ball in the first half. You can see my wing backs aren't quite getting up high enough. And the boys in the middle, they're not really making it happen. So we need to do a couple of shifts in the second half. So I'm going to ask them to play through the middle because that's where the strength is. And I'm also going to have a little look at what I'm doing with the wing backs. Got a complete wing back, but he's not getting up high enough. And my other wing back isn't either, so I'm gonna flip the complete wing back to a normal wing back because sometimes, believe it or not, they get a little bit higher up. It also really doesn't help when you accidentally play your centre back, Hermoso, in midfield for a half. So let's put them where they're supposed to. Right, let's see if it works this time. My god. Can't believe he did that. And straight away we have a free kick. Hermoso gets up. Ironic if he scored, right? So much better this half, but 70 minutes gone and Sochi out of a corner to batter takes. Marino puts it in. We can see that first goal of the season. Devastated, but can we fire back straight away? Jao Felix floating around. Correa, Lorente. Is Koke getting a bit further forward? Lorente hits one just over. Felix and Griezmann have both had awful matches. Awful. 6.1 and a 6 for Felix. It's just not good enough. And here comes Alexander Izak. This is what a striker can do. Whips it across. Lodi gets the header. Can we get on the break? Felix, Correa, he's been the best of the front four. Doesn't say a lot. Still holds on to the ball. He's drifting, he's drifting. Whips it across. Cleared again. Comes out to Lorente. Here's Jao Felix. Vesalcho getting a bit further forward. He's in the box. Crosses. Griezmann goes down. Looks like we've got a penalty. We, we'll get lucky here if we get this. Goes to VAR. 
Penalty awarded. Who's stepping up? I've took Suarez off. He was absolutely knackered. Joe Felix, awful match. Puts it away. And we get the draw. But you can see the stats there. Sosh your dad. They'll be a bit angry that they didn't win that one. Right, that leaves us sitting in fourth place. One, two, draw two. But we're just not firing yet. You know when you haven't quite got your system right. So a few more tweaks are up. But we've got Juve next. Right now, Juve. No bigger test than this one, right? Let's see how we do. Juve have lined up with a 4-4-2. Usually in 21, they use two inverted wingers, so it'll be interesting to see. But they've got Rabio on one wing, so I'm not too worried about him. Dybala, free kick. The lit hits off the line. Bang back in for Salcho clears. They've got Morata playing against us, and he's our player on loan. Raging. Throwing deep in the corner. Chesney takes it. I mean, he's a draw against Juve, a bad result, I'm not sure. First game in the Champions League. He hoofs it forward. Jimenez takes it, here's Koke. Here's Antoine Griezmann, nice ball through. Suarez, Joe Felix hits one, just tipped away from Chesney. And it's cleared. While I was sneezing, they go straight up the other end. And who scores against us? Yeah, our player, Alvaro Morata. I'm absolutely sick. Chiesa goes down the right-hand side. I've had a risk, so I put Lamar at left wing back. He's exposed him. Rabio, the guy I slagged off. Morata, our own player. Ah. Second half underway. We're on the attack now. It's a clear the game. Joao Felix is sitting right back there. I need to sort my set players out. But look at him. Coming from deep. This is nice. Can he beat his man? He lays it back to Fasalcio. Back to Koke. Whips it in towards Correa. It's cleared again. We've changed the tactic a little bit. We'll get to that shortly. Here goes Correa. Whipped in from Lodi. Joao Felix. There we go, crew. There we go. We changed the tactic a bit. This all came from our corner, believe it or not. Joao Felix, not known for his heading. I'm going to take that one all day. More so to Lamar Correa. Watch this pick out from Lamar. Bang. Joao Felix gets us back in it. Come on. Round to Frisalcio. We're definitely playing better this half. Cuts inside. Joao Felix. He's having a big say in this. Correa. Here's Lamar on the overlap. Whips it across. Luis Suarez. Big save from Chesney. Now, like I was saying, we're starting to get tired triggering the press. So I'm just going to tell them to back off a little bit because they're absolutely wasted. The 60 minutes gone. We're going to back off for 10, 15 minutes. And then I'm going to crank it back up for the final 10. Nothing doing. It's another draw. That's how we finished the match. You might have a little look at that because it started to get a good flow going on. Only two corners. I'm a bit worried about the lack of creativity. So when we come back next time, hopefully we'll have sorted that out. We'll be going to stream probably tomorrow, so join us on Twitch over there. But Aleco Madrid has started. Bit of a stuttering start, but, but we are undefeated. We are undefeated. <laughs>